Hello, future warriors. My name is Taylor Hart, and I'm a senior admission counselor here at Merrimack College. And I just wanted to pop on here to show you exactly how to submit your enrollment deposit to hopefully make the process a little bit easier. So I'm going to start here by sharing my screen. And then you can see here we have Max profile. And so this is your admission portal. This shows you all the information that you need. It has your financial aid tab, all that great information. You can see congratulations, your admission counselor, and your Merrimack ID number. This is important to note because you have to enter it in later on. So you might want to write it down at this point. But if you scroll down just a little bit, this is the section we're going to be focusing on, the deposit now section. So you can see here, this is the link to submit your payment. And Mac will be paying $700 for their deposit because Mac is a resident student. If you're planning to be a commuter student, this deposit will only be for $500, so just something to keep in mind. And regardless of whether or not you're doing the $500 or the $700 deposit, your deposit will be put forward towards your first semester bill. So something to keep in mind. So now you're going to start here, click on the Submit Payment section, and scroll down a little bit. You can see the payment details, and then once again, Submit Payment. And then at this point, you have a couple of options. So you can either click credit card or electronic check. Both are great. Um, the credit card does have a small fee associated to it. So something to keep in mind. So you can pick whichever option works for you. And then at that point, you would press continue checkout. I press electronic check. So this is the screen that pops up for that. And you would enter in all this information, then continue checkout and continue to follow the steps until you get to that confirmation page. And then you do the exact same thing for credit card, press continue checkout, enter in all this information. This is the list of credit cards that we accept, continue checkout, and continue to follow those steps until you get to the confirmation page. And then that is how you submit your deposit. And we will send you a confirmation email as well. Um, but if neither of those options work for you, you can always feel free to deposit in person and stop by our Welcome Center. Or if you have any issues or anything at all, don't hesitate to reach out to your admission counselor. I speak on behalf of my entire office when I say that we are here to help you. We're here to support you through this process. And we are so, so excited for you to begin your journey as a warrior. So once again, congratulations.